And welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. Okay, I think I figured this puzzle out. Let me just test this. Oh wait, a journal. How have I not read this? They called it the Harvester. They knew it was a terrible mistake and they trapped it within these tunnels. Uh-huh. Our foolish greed led us here. And now we are trapped along with it. Yay. Our only hope is to destroy everything. Wait. I've heard this before. Be quiet. It won't be quiet. Damn it. <laughs> also, I hate New Orleans and I hate the Saints. I do like New Orleans food, though. But screw the Saints. Hate that whole team. Obviously, I'm bitter about the game yesterday. But anyway, I was gone for about a uh, yeah, about five days. Went to me mom's house. Had some delicious home cooked food. It's pretty sweet if I do say so myself. Whoa, what the hell? Oh, I seem to have activated these golems. That's just dandelion. Just what I wanted. Alright, go away, you. I have no time for you, and you're a lot easier than those other golems I randomly stumbled upon that kicked my ass. Ah. Yeah, I did that off camera, what I'm talking about. Um. Uh, there was a room full of boss-like enemies, and I got my ass handed to me, and I said, screw that room. <laughs> Good god, these guys do a lot of damage. Guys, help me out here. And his eye. Um, he's a golem, I don't think that would hurt him. So if I do that, 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 and then this, will that work? Ah, it's the red switch, yes. Alright, time to press it. And I level up. Oh, that is so lucky. I level up right before I'm about to fight that harvester thing. Hell yeah. Well, from what we've been hearing about the harvester, he obviously sounds like a lovely looking thing. Full of body parts and ripping people in half. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, just gotta remember, where is it located? right past here in that little door down there I believe alright now don't freak out on me guys uh oh the game saved that means I must be here okay <coughs> this seems like our other dude is leveled up so let me help him out oh my god get some constitution you will die within 10 seconds of this guy Yes, yes, in there. Yes, including some horrible monster. Oh, well, yeah, I hear it. What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck is that thing? Oh, my God. That is. Oh. Thing is horrible looking. It's throwing body parts at us. What the fuck kind of disgusting creature a hell abomination is this? Oh, this is like something out of a survival horror game. Okay then. The harvester is really difficult to kill, by the way. He has a shit ton of health. In this form anyway. Look how much damage he's already done to us. I can't afford to go down or this battle's over. He does a ridiculous amount of damage, so... Yeah, be wary if you're getting close to him. Pretty much just wail on him. If you're a mage, this battle probably is a little bit easier for you because you can attack him from a distance, even though he'll just start flinging body parts at you. And apparently he can summon ghouls to attack us. Shenanigans, I say. Shenanigans. Okay, over half of his health's already gone. Okay, this is... Oh, Jesus. So it was almost all of mine. Uh. Jesus Christ. How many... Oh, no. I'm out of healing items. Oh, this is bad. I've got to have some more somewhere. If I don't have any, I'm dead. Uh. No. Stay away from me, you monster. I'm so dead. Oh, man. I haven't struggled this hard with an enemy before. Uh, 
And one of our guys is already dead. Great. No, 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 no. You stay away from me, you horrible hell spawn. Get away. <laughs> Help me. It's chasing me. Uh, it's not that scary, but my health doesn't regenerate, does it? Wait a minute. Injury kit. Those don't help me. Wait a minute. This is a healing item, I think. Oh, hell yeah, it is. It's a full health, too. Ah, oh, yes. <coughs> Alright. Now to take out this... Oh, my God. Look at that damage he does. Ridiculous. And my constitution's at 60, and I've got the best armor in the game. And he's doing this much damage to me. God forbid if I was a rogue or a mage going up against this guy, and he hit me once, I'd probably die. I'm at level 30-something, too. I'm at, like, level 31 or 32. I don't remember, but... Uh. Please die. We got so close, I'm not even taking that chance, so... One more hit should do it. There we go. Ugh. Unfortunately, this is a two-phase boss battle. We kill this disgusting flesh with this little guy. We actually take out his real form. And we gotta get to him quick, because I believe he can heal himself. He jumps. Oh, the hell is this thing even supposed to be? And where did it come from? I'm sure on the Dragon Age wiki there's something that tells us about where this thing came from. Uh, did the dwarves create it? I hope not, because why? Well, I don't think they have the ability to create living creatures, but that's kind of creepy anyway. Yeah, why not? Just give me my stamina back. You get out of here. I am not your friend. Hurry up and die. Literally getting very, very close to ending this, which is kind of nervous because I don't have any other projects planned. I'm still doing Resident Evil 4. That's being uploaded on Fantasy Comms, like I've stated a million times. And yeah, there he is healing himself. No. Bad Harvester. Get get out of the wall. Oh, yeah, that's bullshit. Somebody hit him. There you go. He was stuck in the wall for a second. That's kind of lame. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Okay, we should be able to kill him now. He's, yeah. This is a lot easier than his first phase. Oof. Come on. I don't think so. You're not healing yourself. Just a few more hits and this guy is done, yo. I know, such engaging commentary. Now please go back to hell quietly. Uh oh Our golem friend just got smashed. Time to go, Jerry. Forge is destroyed like Darien wanted. The creature is dead. There could be other notes. More information. Dude, this place is about to blow up. Not worth more death. No, not do that. You get out. Okay, yeah, let's get the hell out of here. This place is kinda crazy. Yeah, I better be getting some money from this. I'm still alive. Let's go home. Back to dwarven crap. Fine, dwarven crap. <coughs> Wait, what's that sound? Oh my god, there's like a hundred harvesters. Oh. Well then. I guess it's pretty lucky not all of them came after us, or we'd definitely be dead. Okay. Only one more thing left to do. Witch hunt. We must find my lovely lover, Morgan. She has my baby. And I still want some of that sexy witch booty, yo. Yes. Yeah, I'm not doing the other one, because it's just... We play as the dark spawn through the final part. Why wouldn't you import a character here? Because it would make this whole thing useless. Where am I? There I am. And there's me from regular origins. It's not all bulked up like me. Oh, wait. Actually, no, that was me from, uh... Yeah, because... Okay, I want the highest leveled me. Where's me at? 
There I am. Level 32 warrior. Yeah, the top one. Should have should have known. God, I can't believe this game's almost over. I love this game so much. It's kind of weird. I'm kind of sad to be almost done with it because I love this game so much. Oh, well. Got it eventually. Flemeth once told me that temptation lies in the forbidden. Best name ever. <laughs> Doggy! Do not follow me, <laughs> Well, I am. Words I have never spoken. Some doors should never be reopened. Oh, I'm gonna open your door if you know what I'm saying. But I already did that, so I'm gonna do it again. Flemus Hut, okay. Hey, look, it's our doggy. Yes, I think it is my. S yeah, it is the same dog. Yay! It's been so long, doggy. Woof <coughs> woof. We'll find Morgan, won't we, puppy doggy Jad thing? <coughs> All right. Yeah, I keep barking. What, I have to rename the dog? Well, I'm sorry, Jad, but I'm going to rename him something else, just for the hell of it. Uh, You know what? You, sir, shall be... <laughs> I have the mind of a three-year-old. A penis, yes. Do not judge me. Alright, my dog is leveled up. Okay, wow, level 32 dog. It's pretty powerful. There you go, doggy. Just level up all this. Okay. So apparently we have to go back inside the hut. I hope Flemeth, you know, doesn't reappear. Apparently she's not dead. Spoilers, even though we kind of killed her. Who the hell is that? It's an elf. Oh, man. Get her, doggy. Get her. Not another step. What are you doing here? I'm looking for stuff. Hey, that's racist. Don't call me that. Down, boy. Down. Fine. I'll start then. I am Ariane of the Dalish people. My keeper sent me to find Ashabellinar, the woman of many years. Ah, so you're looking for Flemeth. I kind of, you know, killed her and all that good stuff. Many have tried to kill Asha Belinar in the past. Do not claim victory until a few centuries have passed with no sight of her. Well, I'll be we dead by then. find her daughter, Morrigan. The young witch has caused trouble for my clan. Oh. Has she earned your ire as well? Well, you know, I, uh, kind of love her and all that stuff. <laughs> they say she is beautiful. But I have never heard anyone claim she is capable of love. Oh, she Morgan loves me. An ancient book my clan has guarded since the days of Arlathan. We were the only ones with such a piece of our history. Everything we once had, all legacy of our ancient magics, were stripped from us. First by the Tevinger Magisters, then by the Wretched Circle. And Morrigan took what little was left. Aww. Oh well, yeah, she kind of does that. She does what she wants. How do you know she stole it though? Visited our clan in the name of friendship, and took great interest in our history. <laughs> she knew exactly what she was looking for. Oh, you naive elves! Two nights later, it was gone. <laughs> for almost two thousand years, the Dalish people have been wanderers, a shadow of what we once were. This book, as much of a mystery as it is to us is one of the only clues on how to reclaim that past. My keeper, Solon, says it was a treatise on something the ancients called Alluvian. Oh, the mirror. The word the is as old as the book itself, and its meaning has been lost, save perhaps to Morrigan. So what do you want me to do? Of course. Morgan, and we can aid each other. The book of Alluvian was reclaimed from my clan by an elven mage who stole it from the Circle of Magi before defecting. Mm -hmm. He said other similar treasures remain in the library, but they would never allow a Dalish to view them. Perhaps you will meet a different reception. Perhaps? Sure, why not? I'm a Grey Warden. Masirinus, I look forward to working with you. Yes, yes, dog. Yes, yes. <coughs> so, you know, being the commander of the Grey, 
I've got special privileges and can do whatever the hell I want and all that good stuff. Hellfire! Dark fire! No. Doesn't look like it's been slept in for a while. Oh my. Where the hell did Morgan sleep in this house? And where the hell did Plymouth sleep? It's a tiny little hut. Hope they didn't share a bed because it's not very big and it sounds kind of dark spawn. Really? <clears throat> now, dark spawn. I help the architect, so you best leave me alone. Go get free. Don't don't attack me. Oh, fine. Then you can die. <laughs> Flemish demise. Oh, that sounds like an interesting codex to read. But if you want to read it, just go to the Dragon Age wiki. I have not the time to sit here and read the codexes. Oh, looks like we have to go to the Circle Tower. Fair enough. Because I had such a lovely time there last time I went, you know, abominations. Aw. I thought Lothering was still alive. I was like, can I go there? The place kind of got destroyed, but okay. Yes, abominations and Templars and... Crazy magic in the fade. Good times. Welcome to Ferelden's Circle of Magic. Please keep your hound under control. Some of the apprentices are easily startled. <laughs> and I'll, I'll, ki I'll kill them. Elf with you. Is that a problem? Yo, whoa, whoa! She can be trusted. Come on now. What is that supposed to mean? Most Dalish are common thieves. Well, racism. <laughs> the circle is glad to have you as a guest. As you can see. Things are much changed from when you were last here. I'd hope so. I hope you guys aren't, you know, still crazy. To some important business. My name is Hadley. I lead the Templars in the Night Commander's absence. And I don't care. I need to go to the library. You can start in the index section. As the Warden Commander, you and your guests are free to explore the first floor of the tower without an escort. Good day to you. Fair enough, I suppose. <clears throat> uh, being a Grey Warden has such good perks. Nope, control yourself, young lady, control yourself, or I will force you to do naughty things with the dog and film it and put it on the internet and make people cry. That sounds horrible. <laughs> Ooh, oh, wow, these runes. Pretty awesome. Too bad I'm getting them at the end of the game. <laughs> Wait, what? No. I'll tell you about it later. <laughs> what about... S whoa, 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 you whores. What are you talking about? I heard something happening in between the sheets. That's borderline pornography, and there could be children watching this. Control yourself. Oh, sweet. Look at all this awesome stuff in here. So, we're back in this tower. I was not. What? Oh, you're talking to the dog. Sandal? Again? Hey, Chapman? What the hell are you doing here? Exactly. Yes, yes. Be quiet, doggy. So where's Bodan? Bodan is trading in Redcliffe. If you're interested in his goods, I believe Santa has some of them to offer you. Sure, why not? Well then, Sandal just seems to appear out of nowhere. Like, all the time. It's kind of crazy. Uh, would you have anything of interest? Sure, I'll buy some of these health items. I really have no reason not to buy them, considering I have all this money. 347 sovereigns is quite a bit. <laughs> Open the door. I don't see a whore, though. Yeah, you could spend a lifetime reading all these books in here. Is that a pure I wish I had one. They should have it. Well, you know, Anders was talking about having a little cat, and they forced him to go baba. That was pretty mean. How could they do that to a kitty? But he has Sir Pounce a lot now. You think you could sneak up on the mage over there? What? Stop trying. Stop trying to cause trouble, you crazy little girl. Hmm. 
Looks like we have books to read. Oh, man. Uh huh. Don't tell me this is a you gotta go find where the book is things. Uh, I've only done this once before, so my memory may be a little bit rusty. So apologies in advance if I tend to not find my way around here. Worst case scenario is I don't figure it out and just say screw it and come back later. Which I'm getting pretty hungry and oh my god, I just remembered today was the release date for the new wait. Is it? No, it came out yesterday. Yeah, the new Paper Mario's out. I haven't been hearing that many great reviews. Uh, it's gotten like an 8 out of 10 or something like that on most reviews. Which is, which is kind of sad for me because, for me, a good game, you know, it, it has to be like at least an 8.5 or higher to even be worth looking into. So it sounds like it's just average, unfortunately, but uh, I'll pick it up. I have it pre-ordered and I loved all the other Paper Mario games. Yes, even Super Paper Mario. Stop being spoiled little children and complaining when they make changes to video games. Especially when it's not bad changes. If it's Resident Evil 6, then yes, complain. <laughs> uh, none of these books are doing anything. Joy. Oh, I got something from that, apparently. Okay. And this bookshelf is shining. Under the bridge. Da, 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 da. Something about elves, I'm assuming. No, okay. Alright, okay, Emma. I must get something to eat and go to GameStop. <sighs> Which the nice people at GameStop have so kindly offered to give me the Paper Mario poster that's sitting in there, so I'll have more video game memorabilia that will be stockpiled for no reason. Like, literally, I'm going to have to start either selling some of this stuff or giving it away, because I've got a lot of video game memorabilia. Like, I'm not, I'm obviously not going to give away just regular video games, but uh, I've got a lot of posters and crap like that. Too many to hang up, and uh, not enough room for them. If I had my own house, then yeah, I'd <coughs> say, yeah, no problem, but uh, I don't. I've got a room over here at my grandma's that's not a permanent living space, and a room at my mom's that's not a permanent living space either. So I'm always in constant panic of, oh man, where am I going to live, type of thing. Good times, good times. You know, I take a mortgage out of the house, but you're, you have to have like a job for, a, for an entire year before you can get a mortgage, so... <laughs> and I need a key! Okay, I seem to be a little bit lost. Yeah, I think I'm going to call it a day because I don't know where that book is. Alright, join me next time where we hopefully get close to finishing this game and finding that book or whatever. I don't know. See you guys. Go watch Resident Evil 4 on Fantasy Comps or something. <laughs>